that's something that's become vogue around the league. <laughs> he was doing it early, though. L.A. play action first and 10, going for it all from the 38-yard line. Oh. And did he make the catch? Did McTeel make it? Incredible catch. Ricky McTeel, the number one draft choice. How in the world did he catch it? He's been doing it throughout training camp. They will tell you right now that this first-round draft pick out of Florida is a genuine superstar. And what speed he just flew by Langford. And... Let's talk about the arm, too, Dan. It well, was brilliantly thrown. Lankford can't believe the ball went that far. I look at Ricky Natil. Look at the eyes on the ball. Lankford really in pretty good coverage. That's excellent coverage. What more can you do? Oh, that I is... don't know what was better, the catch or the throw. Oh, that's an unbelievable catch. There have not been a whole lot of those made. That was absolutely beyond belief. He Slipping. kept his hands down like you have to do in a full sprint, put him up at the last second. He really one-handed that, turned his body so that he wouldn't fall on the football and lose it, and just an absolutely superb effort. Well, I'm going to have to do a little counting. How far did that ball go in the air? Now, I'm not a math major. I'm going to have to start doing a little calculation, but that was <laughs> 55 or 60, but flat-footed, too. The, the line of scrimmage was the 38-yard line. There he the is. Let's watch John drop back. Little play action. He sets it as 30. He launches from the 30-yard line. And the teal actually makes the catch with the ball right at the right at the 12-yard line is where the ball came down. 58 yards. A modest little toss. Mm -hmm. With a one-step <laughs> delivery. With touch, a spiral, and perfection at 58 yards. Oh.